What's up, freaks? Just want to do a quick Friday roundup, quick video, and today actually should be the day that you're doing your weekly video of your weekly recap of just what were some of your victories for the week and what were some of your struggles for the week, what you need help with most of the week, this week, this past week, and see how we can help you out, see how the other freaks can help you out, see how the coaches can help you out, see how I could personally help you out. And I really want to just stress this this challenge that's going on, whether or not you're even in the challenge, it really doesn't matter. It's just to help hold you more accountable. And as you've seen, it's not like a traditional weight loss challenge. Yes, you're just going to happen to lose a shit little weight and continue to get in the best shape of your life and get back on track and get refocused. And really, that's what this is all about. It's about refocusing, which is going to eventually lead to your weight loss. But the weight loss is the byproduct. The weight loss is the added bonus. This is all about establishing your habits and rituals and really what really what it's about is not just us the coaches holding you accountable or the other freaks holding you accountable it's about you holding yourself accountable learning to hold yourself accountable and not just learning to hold yourself accountable what that really means is learning to motivate yourself because accountability is motivation discipline is motivation you, you can't wait for motivation to come from external sources. You need to learn to motivate yourself. And you do that by holding yourself accountable. You do that by creating habits and rituals, like the things that we're doing for in the six week challenge, you should be doing whether or not you're in the challenge or not. It doesn't matter. Things like waking up the same time every day, no matter what you have scheduled, whether you're still working at home, whatever it is, weekends, doesn't matter. Waking up the same time every day. Maybe on the weekend, if you earned it, giving yourself an extra 30 to 60 minutes, one or two days a week, that's it. But other than that, there is no sleeping in. Having this set morning routine that you do every single day as you come up, you go through it, it gets you on track, gets you focused and prioritizing your day, energizing yourself for your day and holding yourself accountable for your day, motivating you for your day, motivating yourself for your day coming up, the morning rituals. Then throughout the day, the habits that you need to build, those small habits like in the challenge are tracking all of your meals, putting all your foods into MyFitnessPal and posting that screenshot of the of the macros, your protein, your carbs, and your fat, doing your Monday progress photo and check-in, do your Monday weigh-in if you want to, if you have a scale at home, whatever works, and then also doing your Friday weekly roundup recap video. This is all stuff that should be done all the time. And part of that morning routine should be scheduling your day, writing in a journal, whatever works for you, meditating, hydrating. And that stuff should be done consistently every day, almost subconsciously. Like you should wake up and it just gets right to it and it just sets the tone for your day. What that's all going to do is giving you little wins. You the, the, The secret to success in weight loss, really the secret to success in anything is stacking little wins. I know everyone wants a a swing the bat and hit that big home run and get all the glory from that home run, but the reality of it is that the home run rarely, really not at all, is what what, what a big factor in getting your success in your health, your fitness, your just life in general, success in your career. That home run swing is not what gets you there. It's the small little wins, the small little victories. And you need to learn to appreciate those. Write those down every day. Write down your five victories from the day before. And if you think you can't come up, and I have I have private coaching clients that I have do this. They have to write down five victories every single day, along, along with a whole bunch of other in a journal and a debrief every single day, seven days a week, they have to send to me. And sometimes they, can, they only put two or three victories from the day before. And that I'm, t- I'm here to tell you that is bullshit. That is bullshit. You have so many small wins and small victories every single day. You just have gotten used to it and gotten complacent and and forgot how to appreciate those, appreciate those little things. Stop looking for that big home run. We're not just saying the big, massive things. The small, little wins, stacking those small, little wins are what's going to get you over the hurdle. It's going to get you over the obstacles. It's going to get you past the craziness. It's going to get you through adversity. Is stick into your habits, stick into your rituals, stick into your routines, having the discipline, holding yourself accountable, generating internal motivation, and stacking those little wins and appreciating those little wins. It's singles and doubles that wins the game. 
successive, consistent singles and doubles that just keep bringing the runs in, bringing the wins in, bringing the victories in. So you need to appreciate those singles and doubles, appreciate those little wins, those little victories. It's it's mandatory for success in all freaking areas of life. So take that into, into account when you're doing these little, these little tasks, these little habits, these little daily things. Set your own daily routines, especially your morning routine. Like I, I could tell you up to the minute, I mean, pretty much my entire day, I could tell you what I'm, I'll be doing two Wednesdays from now at 2 p.m. I, I could tell you exactly what I'll be working on. But even more accurate, up to the minute, up to the second, you should know what you're doing for your first 30 to 60, even 90 minutes of waking up. Like, what are you doing at that each specific minute? It should be so dialed in your, your routines and your habits and your rituals. That's what it's all about. And now you have the additional habit challenge of drinking a certain amount of water. This is These are all small wins. That's the purpose of all these different tasks that you have for these challenges and different tasks you have here on the VIP page is to help you keep stacking those wins, those little habits, and make them become automatic, make them become subconscious, where it's just leading you towards success, leading you towards excellence, leading you towards the next level, and really ultimately leading you towards control of your freaking life, and, and, and on top of that, leading you towards freaking happiness. That's what it is all about. It's all anyone really freaking wants. Follow the habits, follow the rituals, follow the morning routines, have some discipline, hold yourself accountable, generate your own internal motivation and keep stacking the small wins. I want you to put in the comments below or if you just want to send me privately, tell me about some of your small wins for the day and small wins for the week. Stack them. You should have tons of them. You should have for the week, you should have a hundred of them, a hundred of them minimum five a day. So put down in the comments, what are some of your small wins for the day, small wins for the week? Or if you want, just, just message me privately. If you have any questions, if you need help with anything, you need help with anything we're talking about here or just anything in general in the gym, out of the gym, you know, being more productive, more efficient, help with your, your workouts, the training, modifications, whatever it is, making things harder, making things easier with the nutrition, food choices, whatever it is, just send me a, a message we're here to help you, to help you build these habits, to, to have these rituals, to turn you into a freaking discipline machine. That's what it's all about. So just put a comment down below what your victories are, what you might need help with. Make sure you do your video today of your, your weekly roundup video. I will talk to you soon. You are freaking awesome. No excuses.